Hey guys, so the lighting is a little bit interesting in this video. Um, I have fluorescent coming from this side and natural light coming from this side. Um, I don't have anything fancy in terms of lighting, so I kind of make do with what I can. Um, but today I wanted to start something that I would like to do every few videos or so. Um, it's called what I would really like to do with Fun Science Fact is share with you guys some information that I know or that you guys have shared with me previously to the video and just kind of inform you guys about stuff that I think is pretty interesting about science. Um, so because I study biology, most of the facts that I share will be related to biology, but I definitely don't want those to be the only facts. Um, so it would be really awesome if you guys could leave comments below or videos and share some interesting science facts that you think um, of with me. And that would be really cool and maybe eventually um, down the line I could have a video that's all of you guys' fun science facts um, or maybe integrate in some of yours with mine. Um, that would be really awesome, but uh, big dreams, right? <laughs> so today's fun science fact is that when praying mantises mate, um, the females will actually, more often than not, eat the heads of the males. So this actually helps mating um, become more effective. The nerve endings that control the mating in the males um, is actually in their abdomen, not their heads. So the heads will actually inhibit the mating of the males. And once the heads are gone, the males will mate with the females more and more and pretty much will mate until the females are finished. So. Uh, in most species of praying mantises, the females will cannibalize at least the heads of the males, uh, sometimes more. And there's a lot of different reasons that researchers think that this is. Um, obviously, it's more effective uh, because the head nerve endings are no longer interfering with the abdomen nerve endings that control the actual mating. Um, there's also sustenance that the female can get to provide to her new young. Um, so there's a lot of different reasons why this would be effective for the females. Uh, but basically, there's, there's your fun science fact for today. Um, so I've linked down in the bottom bar to a couple of articles and um, peer-reviewed journal articles that would actually give you guys a little bit more information about it if you want to learn any more about sexual cannibalism and praying mantises. Um, it's a pretty neat subject and it's pretty easy to understand. You don't need to know a whole lot about insects and their nerve endings and all of that kind of stuff. Um, so. That's all I got for now, and I will see you guys tomorrow. Alright, bye for now.